Good morning, family. Fear and depression are very, very damaging. It is vital to be very joyous always and not be to become depressed about anything in the world. Regardless of what is happening and what happened. For times like this, it's vital that one increases his trust in God. The things we are experiencing right now is that the world has distanced itself from God. In Exodus 20 verse 3, it says, I am the Lord your God. There's no other God. We mustn't make anything our God. It is our time these days, in times like this, to return back to God wholeheartedly. Accepting him as the sovereign Lord of the universe. Dedicate yourself to God as your master. Renew your commitment to follow his will. That means we have to repent. Repentance requires change of character. Repentance with an eye to the future. You repent because you need a better tomorrow. Make the necessary modifications in your character starting from today, starting from now, so that your behavior in the future will be right and proper. These days, these times, we have to be reading back our Psalms and these are the daily Psalms that we got to read. Psalm 16, Psalm 32, Psalm 41, Psalm 42, Psalm 59, Psalm 77, Psalm 90, Psalm 105, Psalm 137, and Psalm 150. As you read these 10 Psalms every day, you'll be amazed at your spiritual life. Yes, coming back to what is happening in our country and world over, may we love one another. In Leviticus 19 verse 18, it says, and you shall love your neighbor as yourself. May we manifest genuine love to all. Give a helping hand to someone who may be passing through a challenging time. Show love as a Christian. Let us not just talk about love, but show love, manifest love. Obey the laws of the land, stay indoors, do what you've been instructed, because obedience will save your life. Shalom.